J J you already know. See your boy Joe back at it again, man. Codingface.com. I done did it again. <laughs> Alright guys, so listen man. Today's topic is gonna be my biggest regret as a web developer, as a programmer. Right? My biggest regret. This is the only thing I regret. And <laughs> what I regret is the fact that I got interested in programming web development at the age of 14 and then I left it alone and never came back to it for 10 years a lot of you guys might see this and be like man I relate to this because the first time that I try to make a little page a little oh uh, you know a little change of my MySpace page or or whatever right or Zanga or uh, you know for the old school people like me <laughs> angel fire or what was the other one geo cities on yahoo like for us those were the moments where we got first introduced you know introduced introduced <laughs> introduced <laughs> to web development programming in general right so that was the first time that we got a little taste of it and like now when I look back on it, I'm like, man, why the hell this shit took me 10 years to do? Like I could have been doing this a long time ago. Like seriously, I could have been doing this since the age of 14. Like who knows where I would have been at right now, right? What level of skills I would have right now. Like that's like my biggest regret, you know. But what I'm thankful and I'm grateful about is the fact that even though it was 10 years later when I started like started looking into it and started learning it wasn't too late it wasn't like you know I was like 40 something 50 something it was okay I was 24 when I, I got into this so it took me a little while but at least I got into it you know what I mean like this could have gone the other way, I could have just continued doing everything else that I was doing with my life and just wasting my time. And then later on, I would have came back and tried to learn web development. But luckily, I, I, I figured it out, you know, at the age of 24. You know, I could have been doing so much. <laughs> That's my biggest regret, man. Like right now, you imagine me, that would have been like what? Fucking almost 20 years of doing web development like i would have been nasty right now like i'm already nasty but i could have been nasty nasty with the code man you know so those are my biggest regrets right there man that the fact that you know i got interested in, into this thing at 14 i could have just continued from there on you know i didn't have no support back then but who cares? Who cares if nobody supports you? You're supposed to continue and just do it for yourself. You know what I mean? But I was so young that I, I didn't understand that. I was like, oh, man, nobody supported me. Uh, fucking my mom is telling me to get off the computer. Okay, I'll leave this shit alone. But I was always in love with coding. I always loved the idea of opening something up and being able to just go in there and be like, okay, cool. This how this thing works, and if I break it and take it into a million pieces, I can put it right back up together. So I used to love doing that. I used to open up the controllers in the house, open it up, see where the batteries would go, what did it connect to. Like those are little things that you know. Sometimes, if you know, as a parent like me, now if I see my son interested in those things. Like I'm gonna try to help them and push them to, to continue on that. You know, it's like it's like you have a kid. A kid goes and plays basketball every single day. You kind of pick up on those things. You be like, okay, maybe he likes uh, to play ball. Maybe I should get him in, inside of a team. You know what I mean? Like I didn't have none of that. And I love my mom. And I'm not saying that uh, I'm putting a lot of fault on her, but at the same time, it was like, man, you know. Like, I hear the story of, like, Mark Zuckerberg, like, 
you, you look at the video where when he got accepted to Harbor, like there was like you know that father helped him out so much and like got him the best schools, uh, you know, bought him a computer when he was really, really young. Like, you know, little things like that can really push you forward, man. And like for me, that's like one of my biggest regret. Again, I gotta say, cause you know I could have been doing this a long time ago. Like the things that I'm learning now, well, I learned five years ago, and the things I'm learning now, I could have been doing this, you know, like fucking 15 years ago or some crazy shit like that. You know what I mean? Like, who knows where I would I would have been building by now. You know, so those are my regrets. Those are the things that I tell you guys, like, yo, take advantage. It's never too late to learn how to cope. It's just about, you know, being disciplined and and just going all out. You know, I did this real quick of today's web developers lunch break. <laughs> but I tell everybody, um, yeah. If you're new to the channel, you know, whenever I have a lunch break, I come out of of work, I come chill, and the big body bends. <laughs> I just be an asshole right now. But yeah, I just come to, to the car, chill, record a couple of videos for you guys of things that happen that at that moment. Like this is something that I just got right now. Like this is a, a thought that came into my head and was like, man, what do I regret about web development right now, man? Like, what's my biggest regret? And, you know, it's just the fact that I didn't continue with this when I was 14. I should have just continued. You know, it's like, I tell you guys, too. You guys come here and you're like, y'all get interested. You know, so many people sign up to my website. Not everybody gets to finish all the courses. Not everybody gets to even start it. I've seen people who go in, sign up, and don't even start a course. And I'm like, wait, what? <laughs> you came in, you paid. And I know you want to support me, but at the same time, my channel is not for me to just, hey, let's just throw money at Joe. No, my channel is for you to take this as motivation. And if I can come in and create a course for you to help you out, cool. Hallelujah. Right now, if I can't, I will still tell you, hey, go check out this course from some, this other person who's really fucking good. Right. So the idea here is for you to get into this get motivated become a developer um learn how to program this is just the beginning you know don't give up right away just because you got into a problem doesn't mean that you can't figure out everything else it's not that hard guys all right trust me like if i can do it you can do it all right i'm gonna see you later you already know it's your boy joe back at it again codingface.com please guys check out the description if you can, man, sign up for my website, codingface.com. I got a bunch of tutorials there. I got a bunch of courses. And right now we're working on the Laravel course. If you want to become a full stack developer, meaning a developer, not just saying, hey, I want to become a front end developer. Front end developer, all you need is HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. And that's it. You call it a day. But if you want to call yourself a developer, meaning you could do everything, if somebody comes in and tells you, hey, could you build me a social media net social media network? You're gonna be like, Yeah, I could do it. Right? Can you build me an API to connect to a phone? You're gonna be like, Yeah, I could do that. You know, like anything. Anything that anybody wants to come up to you and be like, Hey, can you build me this? Then you say, Yeah, you're gonna find it here on my website, man. So check it out, man. And at the same time, Zora nine dogs. Listen, it's a whole new world right here, man. When you click show more, you're going to see everything, all right? You got 50% off to my website, codingphase.com, automatically because it came from YouTube. That's the coupon code, kids, all right? And then from there, you got um, our sponsor links, of course. But it's crazy because I'm sponsored by them now, udemy.com. But it's crazy because they taught me how to become a developer when I was doing this by myself. And I'm proud to say that. I'm proud to say, hey. I'm actually a developer who's successful, and I'm doing my thing thanks to Udemy. Okay, guys, check those links out. Best instructors in the world, they're right there. Trust me, guys. Believe in me. All right? And then from there, you got the Discord, which is basically a chat room. It's a, a way to communicate with each other. Like, you know, all my friends are in there. You got your boy, Matt. You got your girl, Barbara. You got a couple of people in there. 
You know, we got Cam. We got the whole squad is in there, guys. Listen, check it out, man. Put in some time. Just click on that link, show more, and you will see all the most valuable links. All right, guys. Fun don't stop here, man. The fun don't stop just on this video. There's a whole community to this. CodingFace.com. I'll see you guys later. Bye.